Please do subscribe to my channel by clicking on that subscribe button and please also don't forget to hit that notification bell icon to be the first one to receive the updates on this channel. What's going on guys, Janus here and my oh my! <laughs> The new update isn't coming in Aeroflight and this update is actually a blast. <laughs> oh my god guys, I just don't know how this started but guess what guys? John Wick is actually making an entrance in Aeroflight. Yes, the collaboration between the John Wick and the Aeroflight is actually 100% guaranteeing our chance to obtain a 5 star net John Wick character right away isn't that amazing guys just look at the banner and you can directly say that you know uh, like Air of Light is actually you know like uh, placing it as in the like like uh, in the same place as the you know how, what, what do you call that place uh, the continental yes in the continental and his loyal dog is right over there as well. Damn, so cute. <laughs> oh man, just look at it. Air of Light, John Wick, all right. All you need to do is pre-register and you are up for a very sort of rewards, guys. It's very easy to you know, like uh, <laughs> claim the rewards and you can see like all the sort of characters in the Air of Light is actually uh, welcoming John Wick, guys. And guess what, guys, for me as well, I'm a fan of John Wick, a big fan of John Wick, and I believe that this thing is actually gonna change the outcome of this gaming history, guys. I mean, like, this is gonna be a very big hype in this game, and I am just hoping, just hoping, unlike any other summit out there in this game, may this John Wick have a very serious, damn serious skill, guys. Very, very hurtful skills that would make him really the John Wick, guys. The assassination that, I mean, like, the assassin that he actually deserved to be, all right? And the next thing is, Air of Light X John Wick update pre-registration underway. So you need to pre-register, guys. It's very easy to pre-register in this game. Uh, and you are gonna get that 5-star summon stone DPS plus 50 million gold. <laughs> oh my god. 50 million gold for God's sake, damn it! I mean, like, if you are a beginner, this is a huge chance to have a very good, uh, you know, kickstart in this game right away with a free five star net John Wick on the way, all right? Which I'm gonna, you know, like, discuss a little while later. All you need to do is please enter your date of birth. You must be 16 or older to participate in the pre registration. Yes, all you need to do is, you know, like, uh, write the uh, month and then the day and then the year right and after that when you click on the enter you will be asked your email address and then like uh, just say like you agree all the terms and then like yes voila you are done guys after that you are done and then this uh, thing is actually gonna be sent through your email it says I believe in your email they will be sending you the coupon code with which you will be able to claim these awesome rewards which i believe that's gonna be the way all right so please do it right away and it's gonna be all right and the next one is air of light x john wick john wick collaboration update special rewards all right oh my god he has the blood in his shirt and eh. okay 100 percent chance to obtain five stars john wick for free <laughs> that's why i love this air of light i mean like can it get better than this Yes, it can in the near future, you know, like, let the mystery be in the future, all right? I'm like, let's just, you know, like, wait for that one. But for now, 5 Star Zone Week is gonna be our side for 100% chance free, guys. That is just amazing. I believe, I mean, like, I hope he can actually be attained in sort of, like, select summon stone. So that, like, we can actually choose between fire, water, and forest. But that is, that has not been actually, you know, like, uh uh announced yet but if that would be the case it would be so better guys because obviously there is a total difference between fire water and forest type uh usually the fire type of the like five star net servants are better than their counterparts so that would be really great guys but if it's random then that can be a little bit of risk as well but still we are getting a free five star net john wick plus another five star dps transcendent summon stone so that's like two five star net servants just like that with 50 million goals isn't that amazing yes it is for me so air of light x john wick 
John Wick collaboration pre-registration yes and yes we have been doing the check-in race event and we will be able to use that points afterwards this update which is gonna be kicking out very soon guys log into the air of light and check out uh, check out pre-registration event. So that is how it goes guys. So amazing. I just I'm just I'm in love with it guys So much good. So 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 good guys. And the next thing is let's do the update preview that we are meant to do in this video But oh my god this collaboration is so 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 I mean like you know like So sudden I mean like it is just too unexpected guys and so surprising Oh man I've been I, like I've already watched John Wick 1, 2, and 3, and this is the best thing that is actually happening to me right now with my best game and then like the best series, you know, like collaborating together. Damn, dream come true. So, next thing is notice so version 3.6, so it's a major update. So, possibly, I mean, like I think it's kind of guaranteed because it has been like a culture, a trend that you will be receiving insane amount of rewards right after the update all right uh basically saying you will be getting two five star net summoning stone uh plus maybe six times legendary gear ticket or one times awakening stone plus one times instant evolve item all right those are the items that you are gonna get so let's see what is in there this upcoming update all right so 3.6 update summary all right Number one, Air of Light X John Wick. Yeah, that's right. Say hello to John Wick, the boogeyman, and Sophia. All right, added two times. Of okay, now that is the very good feature that I really love, which I am gonna actually discuss in detail later on. Okay, the more the merrier. Summon a servant and get another identical one, and it is so good, guys. In uh, I don't like, uh, like. Just in the surface, it doesn't look like that much, but later on, I'm just gonna discuss about this to you guys, and it is insane, guys. Uh, number three is revamped boss raid, okay? And number four is added infinite PvP call training ground, so you can actually practice more before going into the PvP battles to get sacrificed or become a martyr, alright? Number five, added mock battle to infinite PvP, wow, that's good. Number six, improved elevation effects, yes! So, we are gonna get additional boost up to our stats to deal more damage! And number seven, quality of life improvements. Yes, uh, you know, like it's just a basic user interface uh, improvements. All right. So number, so let's just look into it right away. Air of Light times John Wick. Okay, just look at that. There is a continental inside the Air of Light, or let's say the hinterlands, guys. The continental has shifted to hinterlands. That's what it shows right away. And Every servant in the Air of Light are just looking on John Wick in awe, guys. In awe. Right over there. Damn. Okay. Next thing is Air of Light X, John Wick, new 5 star John Wick, and Shofia. Obviously, our John Wick is gonna be a ranged DPS servant. Whereas for Sophia, I think she is gonna be a balance between DPS and support servant, alright? But I think for John Wick, it's a way 100% guaranteed to be a DPS servant. There is no other way. So, they just messed with the wrong man. A man who now has nothing to lose and everything to gain. John Wick and Sophia has arrived. Just look at those two doggies. Then, the German Shepherd and the Pitbull. Alright. Pitbull, right? I don't know that. Anyways, next thing. Get double the servants. New feature. Two times summer. Oh, man. I I didn't... I, like, like... Oh, just, just, let, let's just discuss about it, okay? At first, I didn't know anything about it, but later on, I, when I just read the description of this thing, it was so amazing, guys. Ever wish you could have another of the same servant? Well, now, you can! Summon a servant and get another identical one using the new two times summon. Yes, it's gonna be a really good, especially for the raid plus summon, because you know, like, if you really are going to have a five star net servant, there's always a challenge for you to get the copies. Actually, like, five more copies of that servant so you can max transcend him right away. That is the biggest challenge in this game. 
in order to max out the potential of your summon and now it's gonna get more easier for you guys because with this two times summon you are gonna get the identical copy of whatever you have summoned so far right away so two times of the summon all you need to do is spend extra 1000 carats all right so if you are high on 1000 carats which i have been actually recommending so many players just save your carrots for the rainy days and this is the one that you are supposed to use your carrots all right so in this time what happens that like you will be getting the identical copy so this is the detail two times summon details one only applies to 10 times summon so if you are summoning just one time it does it's not gonna apply okay so you have to go for the 10 times summon number two requires 1000 carrots yes even if you are doing with the like a normal like uh, epic summon stones right you are still gonna require gonna require that 1000 carrots to do that two times summon but hey guys you are actually guaranteed to have a same identical copy of your five star at seven right away as soon as you summon him or her provided that you are lucky okay anyways uh with the recent update of version 3.5 i guess uh you are uh, provided with a higher chance of getting the five star at seven all right so that's how it goes have fun summoning how are those transcendents? Uh, I'm like transcends coming along. Good, excellent. So new and improved boss rate. So this is what I really like again. All right. So as long as you have already attained your highest score possible, which you think the next day you can just skip the battle. All right. You can just skip the battle and claim your rewards just like that. So. It says, when you skip battle, you will receive the same rewards as the ones you receive for the highest total damage this season. You can only use skip battle once a day. Alright, so that is so cool. I mean like once per day, I mean like, you know like, the battle in the world boss is, it's really, really, really long guys. It's so, so, so long. The boss rate is really, really long. It can take up to like seven to eight minutes i guess so you know like if there is a skip battle button so you, you know like you can just check into the game and do that skip battle right away and claim your rewards and just get out get the hell out of there okay so that's how easy it is all right so it has actually made our life much easier just to claim the rewards all right once a day you don't even have a battle to get the daily rewards number one added skip battle that's what we really love happy with the boss rate points then let's skip the boss raid battle all together play boss raid manually once a week earn a daily reward based on your highest point value for the week and skip the battle yes you really don't have to do that again so especially for the busy players who are really not having a great deal of time to invest in the air of light but they still want to keep on checking out the you know like daily rewards of this game then it is a very good thing for them all right Play once, get all rewards, now that's a sweet deal, okay? So that is so great, guys. New and improved boss rates, okay? So this is great, this is great, guys. Uh, it says, like, I think, uh, uh, like, you know, the new weakness of the boss has been re recently added. So this will actually allow us to deal more damage to them, okay? Number two is, like, it says right over here, adjusted time for combo skill effects okay we have made it so that the time won't stop while the combo skill effects are being displayed that means like there is a like short time in the battle you can uh, end up the battle really fast compared to before okay and number three recommended uh, dps servants are now stronger than ever okay so if there is a recommended dps servant and you use them they are gonna deal more insane damage okay so that is good we have boosted the power of recommended servants enemies at speed defense or speed based stat uh, is based dps servants for each boss so that is good okay so it's getting more interesting than before number four more rewards added to daily rewards okay that is what we really want to see every time right isn't it we have added two more reward stages score more points for better rewards damn okay that's what i really love to see again and again next thing a special bar a place just for new ass welcome to the call training ground okay so you can actually do your training before you actually go into the real mess of infinite pvp battles so that you can increase your chance to do and like you know like uh, you know, like i have a little bit better time defeating your opponents but i think that is pretty much useless okay uh this actually doesn't make much sense for me because like in this game air of light even if you lose you're actually gonna get the same amount of pvp you know like the owner points all right 
and you can use them in the shop so it really doesn't matter unless you are actually looking forward to get onto the top or let's say into the good or better ranking in the game and which obviously you cannot while you are a beginner all right so <laughs> It doesn't make that much of sense, but still, I don't know, like for the fun of it, okay? So it's just right over there. Train and steal yourself for infinite PP, with just what it says right over there. Next thing is, wish I could battle the air. Wait a minute, I can mock infinite PvP, okay? So I think in the mock infinite battle, what you can do is like, you can just click on the user's profile to challenge him or her to a mock battle. Because like in infinite PvP, you really cannot select which opponent you are gonna, like you can actually battle with. But in the mock battle, you can actually choose an opponent and test your power against that opponent all right so isn't that amazing that's too good to be true okay so that is amazing guys i mean like you can actually test your power once and often and you can actually realize what are the distance between or the gap between him and her power all right i mean like your account and their account power level so that is gonna be so good guys i'm like i really love this thing okay now this is the thing that i really love because like i can actually do mock battles maybe with like top tier players in the game and just to see like what are my shortcomings and what how can i actually improve my gamings okay so that's good next one is oh no one more thing okay <laughs> give it to us class relation effect has been added to passive skills oh my god <laughs> okay this is just amazing i love this i love this guys i love this just look at there because for anko before there was there used to be only one relation effect okay right now till right now okay because like still the update is not here so it says for anko in the relation effect if an ally Rem is present, obviously his attack would increase by 100% provided that he is at the 4th awakening stage. But guess what guys, with the new update, he's actually gonna get another 70% of attack boost if there is a tank present in the team. Oh my god, okay so that is a huge attack boost right away. So you are gonna have a better chance or better time actually defeating the like uh, hit 12 floor or omen 12 floor because I mean like honestly to say it has been quite a hell for me to defeat Omen 12 floor he is goddamn powerful he's too good ah oh, man <clears throat> he instantly knocks out my maxed out support servant right away it just pains me all right and then like that is so bad and I was actually looking forward for some you know, like new mechanics or you know like methods on how we can actually improve the uh, stats of our servant and now this is actually gonna give it to us just look at that for tanker class and if if, <coughs> if a servant is up for tanker class he is actually gonna this get this relation effect right away if an ally healer is present HP increases by 70% yes yeah, so he's gonna be more tanky uh, DPS class servant if an ally tank is present attack defense critical damage increases by 70% damn that's good healer uh, decreases the attack of boss rate Bastille Ragnar Lucian by 90% Okay, that is good. That is good for healer. Now we can actually use healer in a very good way in the boss raid boss. All right, and then finally for the support, increases damage dealt to the raid boss. Bastille Ragnar Lucian for all allies by 30%. Isn't that amazing, guys? That is too amazing. Okay, okay. So we can actually do massive damage to the raid boss. Damn. That's good, that's good. Now, this is the time we are gonna see millions of diamonds floating around the screen, all right? Imagine that the servant has it, uh, it all looks stats and the perfect combo skill, but it doesn't have that sweet relation effect. Say no more! All servants are now able to do the relation effects. Damn! This is just too good, guys. Number one, the current relation effects will still be active, but original four to five star servants will get new class relation effect. Damn, that's good. New relation effects can be acquired in the same way as current ones. That is, you have to awaken to the fourth awakening. And the number three, the current relation effects will be activated first. Okay, okay. So make sure to check our relations effects too. Other improvements, all right? You can see the other improvements right over here. Where to obtain? Okay, so these are the basic user interface uh, improvements, all right? Meaning like there is a change in the vision and or let's say a basic gameplay mechanic. I uh, improved the skill lock. Now this is very 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 awesome guys. I mean like this mechanic is just getting this game much better. Make way for smarter skill locks. Now you can lock not only the combo skills but normal skills as well. 
Wow, that is amazing guys. I was actually looking forward for this thing because like when you are actually farming out or providing a very good skill for a 6 star servants as well, you really don't want their skill to be used, okay, a certain case of scenario, let's say for my tank, okay, I really don't want my tank or my healer to use that much of skill because like while they use their skill, uh, you know, like, um, the other skills of my dps class servant or let's say my support class servant they go into a set cooldown so that is not good okay so if i am actually able to lock out those unnecessary skills my game would actually have a very improved you know like efficiency okay so i was actually hoping for this thing to come from a very long time guys and now it's here so this is just great this i just love it Here's to more convenient and efficient battles, alright? So, yes, it is 100% alright. I mean, like, I am in total support with this. I am so happy with this, guys. Where to obtain shortcuts added to the collection? Where can I get the water rain shorts? Which tile? We need, no need to ask anymore, okay? Especially if you are a beginner, this is actually gonna help you a lot. The tip is right over there. If you really want that seven, you can, how you can actually get it, you will be provided in the tips, alright? No need to ask anymore. Why? Because a new way to obtain shortcut for the servant stars has been added to the collection. <laughs> oh, that's good. So if you want to know where to get that specific servant, head on over to the collection and find out with a single tab. Oh my god, isn't that amazing guys? Expanded gear inventory, yes, from the previous 400 years only, but now it's actually, I think, uh, extended up by 50 gears. So. We have a total of 450 gears of stack, right? At least servants getting back. Gears always gets the short end of the stick. Not anymore. And gear inventory can now hold 450 different gear items. Okay, that is amazing, guys. This is what I really love. So, this new update 3.6 is mind-boggling, guys. It's just bonkers. I mean, like, John Wick is here with so many mechanics going on around and if John Wick actually have very serious mind-blowing skills that would just make this game a big 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 hype guys I mean like I am just hoping that John Wick not to have those sort of like redundant skills guys Please, Airflight, make him a little bit more interesting and better in it, alright? So this is it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button to keep on enjoying the contents of my channel if you are still around, alright? So see you guys in the next video, okay?